Um, I'm going to do a video for how to put um, a toddler into a wrap conversion carrier. What I have here is um, a metamorphosis 17 inch body carrier, so that's the in between size. It's got the padded buckle waist and padded strap. So you start by putting your buckle on your waist. I like to sit mine right at my natural waist, so quite high up on my back. The padding I'm putting right into the small of my back so that the buckle does up quite high on my body. What that does is it will keep my little one up higher. And for me, I find that a lot more comfortable. This is Alana, she is two years old, and she still fits quite comfortably into this size of carrier. So I'm just gonna flip her over to my back. Mom, what is it? And then I'm going to reach down the body of my carrier until I can get the straps. And then they come out wide up <laughs> and over our shoulders. If you don't feel like your little one is down far enough in the seat, you can lift your strap straight up instead of down, but she got down in there really good. Once you're here, you have several options, depending on how you like to wear your carrier and where, how long you're going to wear it. You can just go back and then cross under the bum and under the leg and tie in front. You can... Do what they call a Lexi twist, which is to cross up over the back. I sit down because he can come help me. And then under the bum. Or you can reinforce your pass just like wearing a woven wrap. One of the reasons I design my carriers with the hems up is because what happens when I grab the top rail and flip it over is that it flips the wrap over upside down and matches up the print on the back. So I'm using the top rail here and my hand to just slide that up over her bum. And I'm using this hand here to help make sure I get it nice and snug and in the right spot. And then over here we're just going to lift the leg over the carrier. And the same on this side, I'm going to take the top rail, which is the one closer to my neck, and pass it behind my back to my other hand. And then I'm going to just use my fingers to push the fabric up over her bum, making sure this fits just like a reinforced carry in a wrap. Now, if you're finding that your shoulders are slipping off, one thing you can do is tie Tibetan, and that helps. Some people find that helps keep them up nice and tight. By doing it this way, by bringing my strap over this, I don't have to actually tie a knot. So to keep this one snug, I'm going to feed it down underneath this one for a nice knotless Tibetan finish. And that's how easy it is to put your little one into a wrap conversion may tie. But I would do a wrap conversion. Half buckle. Conversion.